This is supposedly a Gerber Bear Grylls uh, inspired multi-tool. But I don't think so. Uh, I think it's a fake. This is something pervasive uh, in the Philippines. Meaning, uh, I, I see this type of tool in a lot of uh, online selling platforms. And I got curious. So I bought it. Uh, it only cost uh, little. So I'm going to open it. And uh, we will see what this supposedly Gerber tool has to offer, to, to offer us. So you have a pouch included. But it's thin. It's, it, it doesn't look uh, durable. It seems to be the material that is uh, also used in eco bags. But uh, at least it has a pouch. So uh, that's a good thing. And uh, it came in supplied with this uh, screwdriver bits. Okay, that's good. That's good. And here is the tool itself. It's heavy, yeah. Huh? I tell you, it's heavy. So that's it. But uh, again, I, I, uh, I'm not, I'm not. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is not a real bear, uh, bear Gerber or Gerber Bear Grylls uh, tool because I don't see, uh, I, I don't see this in the website of uh, of Gerber. This type of tool. And uh, the price is already a giveaway that uh, they just uh, place the name perhaps because the price of this can be, you can get this in the market, in the Philippines, in the, in the Philippine market, no, on, the, on, the, on the online selling platforms for as little as 399 pesos to as low as, to, to as high as 599 pesos depending on the seller. So, I'm going to turn it around. So, not bad, eh? not bad. And uh, let's weigh it. Because as I mentioned, I, 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 I feel that it is uh, heavy. And uh, I'm curious. Okay, that's it. The weight is 290 grams. Yes, it's heavy. It's a big tool, but... It's uh, a bit heavy for, for, for this type of tool. So, uh, I'm going to measure it. Okay, that's 10.5 centimeters in length. The width is 4.25 centimeters. So, all the tools here are placed inside. So you have to open it. No, no tools can be uh, opened from the outside unless, of course, you open the tool. So I'm going to open it. And here is your tool. Here is your uh, pliers. This is a full-size tool. It is spring-loaded. The action is good. The plier head is good, surprisingly, for the price. It's well made. Okay, that's my initial impression of it. And let's see the tools that it has to offer, to offer us. So first, we have this. Okay, we have this knife. We have this blade. And I'm going to measure it. So from the tip, up to the point where there is a blade is 5.5 centimeters or about 2.25 inches. Okay, not bad. It's not lockable. It, it won't lock. But uh, the action is passive, meaning it's hard enough to secure the blade. So... Not a problem. I think it's a, it's it would be better if there's a lock, but there's none. So the 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 hardness or the tightness of the action is actually positive in this case for me. And 
we have this next we have this uh what is this okay this is supposedly a uh, an owl and a reamer combination but we have this blade here which i notice is not sharp there is an edge but it's not sharp so uh, the buyer has to sharpen this thing himself okay then next would be i don't know what this is it's uh okay i think it's supposedly a uh, small flathead screwdriver but but look it's a bit rounded so you cannot you will you will have a hard time trying to open a uh, a flathead screw with this thing so again you have to grind it and uh, you have to grind it yourself to, to make it work actually and then we have this what tool is this okay here okay we have a file and a pry bar which will also double as a medium sized flat edge screwdriver okay i think this is usable unlike the other one on the other side we have this saw okay or lagare in in my language good enough and we have this oh another flat edge screwdriver here which again is quite uh, um, rounded huh, for my taste so you have to grind it down to make it flatten some more and we have this okay we have this uh what's this a mini pointed thing but this is not uh this is actually not a uh, Phillips head screwdriver Ah, no, okay so i know i know i know now this is actually where you will be placing your screw bit adapter this one the one they provided you with with this tool there so you can use the screwdriver bit that you will be needing so uh the other screwdrivers which i'm pointing out that is rounded i mean the flathead screwdrivers so they're already moot because of this one so it, it would have been better if the manufacturer of this tool uh, this fake uh, uh, gerber uh, instead of uh, supplying us with those uh, useless flathead screwdrivers it would have been better if they have provided with us or this this tool with with uh, another functionality okay and then we go on then we have this what is this how do you open it we have this um okay it's hard to open it's hard to open this thing there's oh, okay there's a notch there small notch Okay, this is a can opener and a uh, bottle cap opener combination. And again, there is an edge, but totally dull. Totally dull. You have to sharpen it yourself again. So, what can I say about this tool? Well, it's big. Okay, that's a plus point if you want a big tool. It's quite heavy um the pliers head is good no no problem with that the built-in uh, flathead screwdrivers are a total joke but that is that is uh that is again i i am telling that I'm, i as i said earlier it's already moot because they supplied you with this uh, screwdriver adapter and this screwdriver bits so that's the saving grace there that's the saving factor the blade is okay yes uh, the facade or the finish the aesthetic looks good the price 
for 399 pesos to 599 pesos is good too well you can do better you can buy a lot of better tools than this fake uh, gerber um if you will just add a few more pesos or dollars so that that's my review my review on it so this is a uh, this is a curiosity. I bought I bought it out of curiosity, and uh, that, that that's that's uh, those are my findings. Now this tool is it looks good, yes. The player is usable, yes. Other tools are usable, but uh, save your money and uh, buy buy uh, another another tool. So uh, save your money and add some more. You can buy. A better tool a lot better than this uh, thing but uh, if you happen to bought this one to have bought this one like I did uh, what I'm going to do is to sharpen those uh, can, op can opener blades the owl so that uh, I can make this thing usable so I can make a, uh, a something out of this instead of me throwing it away so that's my review for this uh, fake Gerber uh, multi-tool it's good but then it's not good so thank you for watching and uh, hope you could watch uh, more of my reviews